हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू आवर यूट्यूब लर्निंग चैनल एक्यूरेट ए एस एम ई आई एस ओ इन दिस वीडियो वी शल लर्न सर्क्यूलर रन आउट टॉलरेंसेस रन आउट टॉलरेंसेस आर ऑल्सो नोन एज कंपोजिट टॉलरेंसेस बिकॉज रन आउट टॉलरेंसेस इंक्लूड्स फॉर्म एंड कॉन्सेंट्रेसिटी साइमटेनियसली लेट एस बिगिन नाउ Runout provides control of circular elements of a surface relative to the datum axis. A tolerance zone is created and applied to the surfaces of the tolerance feature of the part. In this drawing, the smaller diameter treated as a datum A, whereas the larger diameter, it is a feature of axis, is controlled for the runout. circular runout and total runout are geometrical tolerances used to control applicable characteristics of surfaces surfaces of revolution and relative to the datum axis rmb here rmb means regardless of maximum material boundary in this drawing it control run out tolerance is specified 0.02 with datum a for the diameter 21.87 to 21.98 these are the limit dimensions of size in this figure we can have the detailing of the specified controls on the drawing a is the datum axis the smaller diameter the axis of that becomes a datum axis a and here the minimum dia and maximum dia are shown and the tolerances of the run out is 0.02 mm run out tolerance zone applies to any circular cross section the types of features controlled by run out tolerances include those surfaces constructed around a datum axis and those constructed at right angles to a datum axis in this figure you can find all the cylinders and the conical surfaces are constructed around the datum axis and the vertical surfaces the planes are constructed at right angles to the datum axis the datum axis for a run out tolerance should be established by a cylindrical datum feature the run out datum is always need an axis and also of sufficient length there should not be a very short length cylinder where we cannot establish a good measurable reliable consistency axis of the cylinder two or more cylindrical datum features having sufficient axial separations either one's datum or the two datums the datums which are separated apart with a good separation between them that is here shown a datum and the b datum and the common axis created between the datum a and the datum b that is called as a common datum a dash b and with respect to that end to end cylinder axis the tolerance control tolerance of run out is to be specified 0.1 mm features used as datum features for establishing axis should be functional such as mounting features that establish an axis of rotation in this figure the datum is shown here ac while deciding the datum it is to be well known for the designer the purpose or the functional requirement of the datum with respect to this it is controlled this conical surface 
in 0.1 mm. When applied to cylindrical, conical and curved surfaces, it means we can indirectly ask a question which are the features where we can apply the run out. So the features are cylindrical, conical and curved surfaces and those surfaces constructed around a datum axis, circular run out controls, cumulative variations of form and coaxiality. So the run out tolerance is the combination of cumulative value of form and coaxiality. In some cases, when a limited area of application is specified, the location of the area shall be dimensioned from the reference to a datum reference frame. This is the explanation given here. The run out is asked 0 0.2 with respect to A and B. Here two datums are shown. A is the small diameter whereas B is the rear surface. The next control of the run out of this dia is given as run out 0 0.2 with respect to A and B. But additionally what we see here is the control is only applied to the length of 17 millimeter. This is a basic dimension. And how to reach for the measurement or to control the run out is the information established from the datum B. From B 7 millimeter onwards the 17 millimeter is the length where run out is controlled in 0 0.2 with respect to datum A and datum B. In this case there is a no limit for the length of the control of the run out. So anywhere any cross sections we can check it. Let us see summary of a run out tolerance. There are certain questions which is most of the time asked by the learners. What is the symbol of circular tolerance? It is a arrow at certain angle. Next question. Can run out apply to cylindrical features? Yes. Next question. Can run out apply to conical features? Yes. Can run out apply to profile surfaces or curved surfaces? Again the answer is yes. In this drawing we can see here is a conical surface where we can apply a run out. The second run out shown here is for the curved surface or profile surface. Is run out required datum? Yes. Can datum be more than one? Again answer is yes. To control the run out depending upon the functionality it could be a single datum as shown here or in some of the cases we can use multiple datums like in these cases here shown C and D again here C and D. Some of the times you can use common datum also. Let us have a practical of measuring a circular run out on a 3 coordinate measuring machine. common datum is established to check circular run out of each journal.
it also measures a width so measuring this circle a run out is checked which is already with respect to established common data end to end journals In this video, let us understand a very complex measurement of the runout of the wall guide and wall seat. With respect to the guide, the wall seat runout is controlled. Measurement is done on three coordinate measuring machine. This measurement is on a Revo probe head which scans and controls the thousands points to construct the geometrical features enhancing the accuracy of the measurement hope that you have liked this video with very easy and simple explanations you can comment how do you see this initiative and suggest more on upcoming videos also we are pleased to conduct training programs at your locations in factories we offer Occam Germany, an international CMM certification course. Basic of GDNT. Advanced GDNT. Stack up tolerances. Surface finish. MSA and other quality tools. For further details, please contact us. And I'm sure you will encourage the initiative of training through YouTube, by subscribing a channel. Accurate, ASME, ISO. Thank you and have a good day.